A lot of changes happening here in the weather department as a big front drops into the state today. It brings us some very gusty winds nearing 40 miles per hour and it will be much colder this weekend. There's also a clipper system coming in on Sunday that will bring a light snow chance to part of the state and I'm still watching a bigger system next week for Wednesday Thursday that could bring us a shot at rain, maybe some ice and a mixed bag and also the potential for snow. It's very warm this morning. Temperatures are in the upper 30s to low 40s. It's 42 in Des Moines. We are expecting temperatures to stay steady this morning and then fall as the day goes on. By noon, it'll be 38. By 2 p.m., 32. And by the time you head home from work and from school, temperatures will be in the 20s. We also have some rain still falling across southern Iowa this morning. All of us got in a little bit of rain late last night. The steadiest of the rain is now nearing the Iowa Missouri border. This is continuing to push south and exits our state here very soon. It is dry in the Des Moines Metro right now and the wind will start to pick up soon. By noon today, those wind gusts will be between 30 and 40 miles per hour out of the northwest. That cold air coming in, the wind will stay strong through the afternoon into the evening, and eventually it will subside by early tomorrow morning. But of course, the temperatures will be a lot colder. As the wind comes in, as the front comes in, we also could see a couple of flurries or a few raindrops. This is what it could look like around 11 a.m. today. Maybe some flakes in Des Moines, a couple of rain showers too. This won't be anything significant, but it is enough to briefly reduce the visibility, cause a couple of slick spots. Saturday will be dry, and then as we head into late Saturday night and Sunday, that clipper system comes in, brings the best shot at some light snow north and east of Des Moines. Accumulation is expected to be minor in our area, but northeast Iowa could see an inch or more in some cases. So the next three days look like this. We drop to 22 tomorrow, 23 on Sunday. Sunday has trended a lot colder. We also have that colder air spilling in on the map here so that you see the wind chills dropping by tonight at 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock. The wind chills will be near zero and then they will be below zero first thing tomorrow morning. A quick look at our whole plumbing and heating 10 day forecast. We will rebound Monday, Tuesday into Wednesday. Next week is that time frame to watch Thursday when we could see rain, maybe a little bit of ice, maybe a little bit of snow, something we've got to fine tune in the next several days. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. All right, we'll keep an eye on that.